Hi, Ernie. Hello, good evening. Good evening. What, what are we going to do tomorrow? Tomorrow is Tina Sester. So you're going to wow. fast. And then at night, you're going to hear the Megillah. And therefore, we elected not to have Dafyomi tomorrow night. Now, oh, I'm, okay. it, I'm happy to teach Dafyomi tomorrow night, later, maybe at night, if, any, if anybody wants to. Uh, we could do it at nine o'clock at night. I think eight o'clock is too early. I don't know whether we'll finish the Megillah by then, etc. Then you have to eat. So if anybody wants to do it, we could do it tomorrow at nine, or we'll just learn a Friday afternoon at 3.30. Okay, the next, the next class is a very short one. So I thought maybe you wanted to do it early in the morning, but if they're, if they're fasting- er, if Early, but Mario, Mario, Friday, Friday, you mean tomorrow? Yeah. Tomorrow early in the morning? Yeah. Nice. No, to, I know it's the is fast. A, to, huh? I know it's the fast, but you know, it's, it, it's okay. Let's do Friday a couple of laps and that's it. Well, my question is, does anybody want to learn Dafyomi tomorrow night at nine o'clock? It's a bit late, huh? Uh, no, it's, after the it's, fall. It's I late, to, it's late. It's late. Then well, we can't learn at eight o'clock. We're going to be in shul with the Megillah. Okay, yeah, I no, think it's okay. off to the fast. People, not everybody runs on the every battery that you have in your system. No, I, I agree with you. That's why I, I said I wouldn't, if anybody wants to do it. Uh, uh, but uh, I mean, Ma Mario makes a good point. Okay. Tomorrow morning, it's, I don't know, people got to dub at eight o'clock, I guess. So. Yeah. By the way, John, Johnny, what time is Minion at Young Israel of Hancock Park tomorrow morning? Tomorrow morning is uh, either the later, the later min. Oh Seven o five. Seven o five. Walter, you're gonna dive in Yavna early. Yeah, six ten. Yes. Okay. That's too early for me. So I, I'm gonna, and I have to give them Hamizrahi to, to young Israel. So I'm gonna go tomorrow morning there. Uh, it's gonna be till eight. I don't think I can do it because I got to go into the office by nine. I, it, it, okay. Tomorrow doesn't work because okay. of the fast and the, and the davening. Okay. 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 I, 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 and I just, I just want to let everybody know so there's a worldwide Shloishim Zoom. First of all, tonight is actually the Shloishim for, for Rabbi Brana. But at 10 o'clock in the morning, there's a Shloishim Zoom, a worldwide Shloishim Zoom um, for, for Rabbi Brana. Can you and send the, the? I'll send the link to everybody. I'll send the link. Please, please. Yeah, please. I'll send the link. It will be very interesting. It will be. It's going to be with a lot of stuff that he did in South Africa, videos of the places that he built, and, and all the different stuff. And there'll be, you know, there'll be very short speeches, but there'll be a lot of uh, inform, you know, information about people who who never knew what really Rabbi Brana did in his lifetime. So it'll be very. Hopefully, it'll be interesting. Please okay. send us the link. No, okay. Bernie, just to, tomorrow is also at 5.55 in the morning and 7.05. Those are the two times. 7.05, okay. <laughs> so, we're on Sadiq Kayomi Bay's uh, on the bottom. Boy, Rav Yosef. Dokut me mesim so the emurim are the kidneys and the fat, which for, korbo, for most korbonos are offered on the Mizbeah. Offered on the Mizbeah. They're not eaten. So we asked yesterday that if a tome mace, what if it happens if he eats from meat of the Korban Pesach in a year where the Korban Pesach was offered in a state of Tuma. So we answered that he doesn't get Kharis for that, even though normally somebody who's Tome who eats Korbanois in a state of Tuma gets Kharis. Since this was a, a Pesach that was Hutra or Dechuya, but Sibor, 
he, there's no chi of cards. So now the Gemara is asking a more complicated question. What if the Tmei Meis doesn't eat the meat, he eats the Amuri in a state of Tumah? Magu. Midi Ishtari Tumas Basar. Once there's a heter to eat the Basar in a state of Tumah, Ishtari Nami Tumas Amuri. So maybe there's also no Kharis if he eats the Amuri. Oh, Dilma. My the history, history, my the law, history, law, history. No, it's permitted. Normally, we don't, we don't we have no heter to eat the Amorim. There's a heter to eat the Basser. So, that which was permitted is permitted. That which was not permitted is not permitted. So, Amar Rav Michti, let's see. Tumas Amorim Meheche Israbi. Where do we learn the Chlau that there's an Isser for somebody who's Tame who eat, to eat the Amorim? Me Tumas Basser. If there's a problem with Tumas Basar, there's a problem with Tumas uh, Emurim. That means if somebody who's Tome eats the Basar and gets Kores, so if he ate the Amorim, he would also get Kharis. Kolechah, the less of the Tumas Basar. But if there's no Kharis when you eat the Basar, less of the Tumas Amorim. So there's no Tuma, excuse me, there's no Kharis when a Tomei person eats the Amorim either. And that's the Halacha. Like the Rambam Paskins, like Rabba. Boy Rab Zera. Amorim Pesach Mitzrayim. Now, the first Pesach that they offered in Mitzrayim, that's called Pesach Mitzrayim. Now, there was no Mizbeach in Mitzrayim. The Mishkan, they, they received a Tzivoy to build the Mishkan the day after Yom Kippur of the first year. And the Chanukas, they finished all the work, Chafei Kislev of the first year. And then the, the, the Mishkan was erected for the first time uh, Rosh Chodesh Nisan of the second year. So at that point, now when you offered korbanos, there is a concept where some of the meat is eaten and some of the fats are offered on the Mizbeah. But in Mitzrayim, there was no Mizbeah. So that's what Rav Zera asks. A Mure Pesach Mitzrayim Hecha Akterinu. Where did they offer Pesach Mitzrayim? Ormele Abayu, man lemelon de lo shviski ofu. Well, how do you know they just didn't roast it and eat it? The kidneys and the, the chaylev, right? The, the parts that are permitted. The old Atan Rav Yosef, Shloshim is Bacho Sayusham. There were three mezbechos, the, the door frame and the two mezuzos, where they put the dam. That's nothing else. So there was no Hector and Murim in, in Pesach Mitzrayim. Mishnah. Ma bein Pesach Mitzrayim and Pesach Doiroiz. What are the halachic differences between the first Pesach in Mitzrayim and the Pesach for generations? Pesach Mitzrayim, Mecho Mebe Asor. You have to purchase the, the, the lamb on the 10th day of Nisa, specifically. It was required to sprinkle the blood. They would dip a hyssop which is a plant into the blood of the animal and put it on the doorpost, right? That's not noye Pesach Doiroiz. V'necha v'chipozon v'layla echad. They ate it one night in, in haste. Then it says with Pesach Doiroiz noye kol shiva, which the Gemara will have to explain what, 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 what is that coming to tell us? So first of all, minolan 
how do you know that all the things that were mentioned in this Mishnah were not noyeg for generations? Tichsiv, dabru al kaladas Yisrael leimor, be'asor lachodesh hazeh b'yichu. Zeh mikhu bin ba'asor, ve'ein Pesach doris mekhu be'asor. Only Pesach Mitzrayim was the lamb have to be purchased on the 10th of Nisan. El me'at, what about when it says, v'yalachem l'mishmeres, Ad yom and then it says ish So hachanami that this that you have to watch the 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 pesach for four days so that it wouldn't get a moon. Maybe only Zeton Bikra Bar Yavim Kodim Shkri Tevei Nacheton Bik, because because there's a din of Zeh. If you're going to be medayik the way you're medayik by by buying the animal on the tenth, because you you were medayik lachodesh of Zeh. So here where it says Vayalachem and Yishmeres, you have to watch it for four days. It also says Hazeh, which seems to imply that the only korban that needed a check for four days is the korban Pesach and nothing else. But we know that's not correct. But Tanya ben Bag Bag Oimir, I mean, I'm with Tommy. Shaton Biker Arbor Yomim Kodim Shkita. How do I know that checking the Corbin Tommy for four days? Shanem Artish Lerula Kriv Libu Moado. Ula Halanu Oimir Vayalachem Lemishmeres Ad Arboso. So Tishmeru Mishmeres. So Mala Halan Ton Biker Arbor Yomim Kodim Shkita. Just like the by the Corbin Pesach, you needed four days checking. So what about Azeh? Because Shani also received Tishmaru. Because it said over there, it's not learned out as a binyan, it's a Xer Shovel. It's not a binyan now. From, it, it's a, it connects it. Freyti Gomorro, Pesach, Doris Nami. Haksi, Vavadatas, Avada, Azeh, Bachodesh, Azeh. Which seems to imply you got to treat it like Pesach Mitzrayim. Should you call up those Chodesh Zeh Kazeh? Every Pesach, even in the future, should be like the original one. Ella, we say no. That is coming to exclude Pesach Sheni, that the dinim of Pesach Rishon don't apply to Pesach Sheni. Says you shall eat the meat tonight. That may be only Pesach Doiris is eaten at night. That no, even that those dinim of eating it at night would apply to Doiris. So then you're back to the question, then what's the Hazed Hazed? Over here, if you're saying it's not related to Pesach Mitzrayim only, what is it for? Rashi says, Perik Brochois, that they learn a hekish to Balai Lazev, Avarti Mitzrayim Balai Lazev. When actually did HaKodesh Baruch go out for Makas Bechoyos? So, El Meyato Dechsi Bechol Are Lo Yoichal Bo. By Pesach Mitzrayim, it says, a uncircumcised man should not eat it. So is that a miyud that only an oral was forbidden to eat Pesach Mitzrayim, but an oral can eat Pesach Mitzrayim? That means that's for Pesach Doris. So el boy lamali. What's v'chol arel yoichal bo? If it's not being medayik Pesach Mitzrayim, what is it for? To teach me, bo ena ochel, avalu ochel b'matzu moror. Being uncircumcised is only a deficiency for eating the korban pesach, but you, an orel can eat matzu moror. El meyata b'chol ben nechal lo yechal bo. It says a person who was geshmadit, somebody who converted to another religion, should not eat it. So hachanami de bo ena ochel avalu ochel lo pesach lo doyres. So again, is the bow only coming to say that that did applies only to Pesach Mitzrayim and not to future doyres? Which refers 
uh, to Pesach Doiroys, the same way you did this, you do this. So then, again, we ask the same question when it says, what is Bo coming to exclude? Somebody who converted cannot eat the Korban Pesach, but, he, but a Kohen who is a Meshumit can eat Shumah. The Itzrich Lemicht of Arel, the Itzrich Lemicht of Ben I have to be taught both Dini, both by Arel and both by Ben Necha. He calls Rachmana Arel. If the Torah wrote by Arel only, fine. Mishum de Mois. An uncircumcised man is disgusting in front of Hashem. A Ben Necha lo Mois. A Ben Necha physically is a normal person. There's no Meisa. So maybe aim Allah, there would be no restrictions. Sri Chai to be told by Ben Nechar. Ben Nechar, Mishum Dei Li Bola Shamayim. Maybe a Ben Nechar, someone who converted to a different religion, he's rejected because his, his lab is not the Shamayim. Av al Oreal, the Li Bola Shamayim, an uncircumcised male, he still, he has strong connection to Kodesh Baruch Hu. So maybe aim Allah, the restriction wouldn't apply to him. So Sri Chai needed to post it by both places. It says that a, a Toy Shav says Rashi Zekonoi Kesef Kinyan Oil of Benirza. A Toy Shav is an Evid Ivri who decided to stay with his master forever. He had his ear pursed. And Sochir is an Evid Ivri just for six years. That's a Toy Shav So he eats the Korban Pesach. It says Toy Shav is Sochir lo Yoichal. Achanami de Bowen, Achla Belochlo, the Pesach Boris, Omar Kravavan. No, the same answer exists. Ela bo lamali. So when it says Toshav is Achlayach bo, what's the bo coming to exclude? Bo mishumado is poiseles. Ve mishumado is poiseles petruma. That someone who converted is possible, but not to truma. Ela meyata umalta oisoi az yoychal bo. If you circumcise him, he can eat it. Again, is it is it doesn't apply to Pesach Doris? What's the bow coming to exclude there? Bo Milas Makebes. So for example, if you don't provide circumcision for your male children or your avodi, you can't eat the carbon pesa. But that's only by pesa. But the ain milas is Petruma, you as a Kohen. If you did not circumcise your sons or, or your avodim, you are allowed to eat truma. By Pesach, it says, don't break a bone. Are you allowed to break bones in future? No, Pesach Doris has the same lot. The love of breaking a bone is only by a kosher dick of Korban Pesach. If the Korban Pesach is possible for any reason, there's no love of breaking its bone. Don't eat from the Korban Pesach raw. Are you allowed to eat the raw, raw in future generations? What's the meat of Mimenu? He, the, he learned to an Orel that an Orel cannot eat Meiser either. That we learned previously. Then the Mishra said, you have to eat the Korm Pesach in haste. The Armor Krav Achatem also Bechipazom, also Nechal Bechipazom, Yenachem Nechal Bechipazom. 
Only Pesach, Mitzrayim was eaten in haste, not future. Then the Mishnah said, Pesach Doris, no equal Shiva. Susie, Susie, I want to eat with you later, okay? okay. Pesach Doris, you, you celebrate for seven days. Now, on my court, what does this mean? Elam, Pesach, Pesach, Koshim, and Nika. We don't offer the Korban Pesach all seven days. You only do that, Erev Pesach. Ela Chomets. It means Pesach, Doris, Chomets is going to be Osir all seven days, which seems to imply that in Mitzrayim, it was only Osir either one night or one day. There, there, was no, there was no seven days of Pesach. It was only one day or one night even. Mechlal, the Pesach, Mitzrayim, Laila, Echa, Besu, Lo. Does that imply that Pesach Mitzrayim was only, there was only Isra Chomets one night? But Tanya, Rabbi Yosef, Le Yom, Yemina, the Pesach Mitzrayim, Shem, Chimutz, and Oyel, Yom, Echa. It was one day, but including the daytime. Tamad Lomer, Lo Yachel Chomets, the Somech Le Hayom, Atem Yotzim. Achi Komer, Laila, Echa. The Pesach, the Korban Pesach is eaten at night. But what did the Pesach Doris? Same thing for Pesach Doris, you eat it the night of Pesach. The Chimutz, or Kol Hayom. By Pesach Mitzrayim, the Isra Chomets was that first, that 24 hours. With Pesach Doris, Noye, Kol Shiva. The prohibition of Chomets is for Pesach Doris is seven days. Mishnah. Arm Yeshua Shamati should Tmuras Pesach Kreva. Who Tmuras Pesach ain't a Kreva. A Tmura, we know, is a Corbin that let's say a Shlomim is standing in front of you. And another animal comes and you say, I want this animal to be a tmur of that animal. So if you make a tmur of a Korban Pesach, on one hand, you can offer it. And on other hands, you can't offer it. Vainly lefarish. And Rabbi Shur did not know how to explain this dichotomy. Om Rabbi Kibani afarish. A Pesach shenim sekorim shechitas a Pesach. You have a Pesach. And it got lost. You were mafresh another lamb. And the original lamb was found. Before you shechted the new Pesach, the din is, Yire hase achi istoy. You, one of the, you choose one of the animals and you offer it. The other one is sent to graze until it gets a moon, and then you sell it the chulen and it's money you, you get and you buy a shlomi. The chen tmuraso. And the same din would apply that if the sheep that you found after you had designated another one, you made a tmura of it, there would be kedusha chal on that tmura. And the same thing, it would, it would go out to mum, it would be put out to pasture until it gets a mum. Which, and that's what he meant when he said that Tmur Pesach is not Kore. Now, if the animal was found Achar Shkita Pesach, Kore Shlomim. And Moiser Pesach, right, a Pesach that was offered that wasn't used. So this is an example of a Pesach which was found after you already shechted a different animal. So it's a moister Pesach. Within is you can carve shlamin. And if you make a tmura of it, you can also carve shlamin. So that's what the Mishnah meant when it says sometimes the tmura's Pesach is carved and sometimes it's not carved. So the Gemara says, Velema Pesach carved, Pesach ain't a carved. So we're really not talking about the tmura, we're talking about the Pesach. Why not say it's simpler? Ha kamashlon, the ikat tmura Pesach, the low kreva. Because there's going to be example the way we learned now that the, when you make a tour of the Pesach, that it's not kore, like we said. Instead, you got to let it graze. Now, itma. Rabba Amar Koydim Shechita Ula Achar Shechita Shanimu. Here, the Mishnah seemed to say, well, it makes a difference whether the animal was found before you shechted the new animal or after you shechted. But that's the act of Shechita. Rabbi Zeyer Amar, no. It's when you're allowed to shech. Was the animal found Koydim Chatzois? That means when you have the capability of checking. The Mishnah very clearly says Shita, not Chatzois. You have to amend the Mishnah according to Rabzeir and say, 
Kitanoi, and there's a machlekes tanoi regarding this. Pesach shvi imtzak kodim shkita yire, lachar shkita yikore. If you find it before you shecht and you choose one, the other one goes to mum. If you found it after the shkitas of, of that one of the pes, of, of, the, of the animal that you chose, now this is a moiser pesach. You can offer it as a shlomim. And Rabbi Yezra record him chatzoyis yire lachar chatzoyis yikore. Then it says, "Achar shkita se pesach yavi shlomim." If you found the either the original animal or the tmura after you shechted the korban pesach, the, the one remember you had an animal, you lost it, you designated another animal, that other animal you shechted, then you found the original animal. That's what we're talking about here. That's a moister pesach. You can bring it as a shlamim. That's if it was found after shechita. The hamir bo, and we said as well that the tamura could also be offered shlom. So Rav says, you know what? That's when you found it after shkita, v'heimer bo'ach ha-shkita. You made the tamura after shkita. Then Yechadami, I agree. Aval nimtza koidim shkita. But let's say it was found before the shkita of the other animal. And then you shechted it. You, not that, you shechted the animal that was going to be the best one. And this animal that was found before the shkita of the other one, heimir bo akar You made a tmur afterwards. Tmur also mikach kedusha dechuya kaos. That tmura now was set aside since it was found before shkita and you elected not to offer it. So it's a kedusha dechuya. And therefore, the tmura of it is low crate. We can't offer that because it came from a kedusha dechuya. Eisvei Abaya, Abaya asked the question on Rav. Says im kesev hu makri, ma tamod loymer im kesev. The rabbis tmuras a pesach that the tmuras a pesach can be offered achar a pesach shekreva shlom. Hey chido ilay mashen in sachar shkita, vehem ibrachar shkita. If the animal was found after shkita and the tmur was done after shkita, so pshita, we know that lama likra. I wouldn't need a pasuk. Elalam, maybe the pasuk of im kesev. Is talking about the case shenim according to shkita baby rachar shkita. So why do you say it's not offered? We have a pasuk that says you you do offer it. Lo says the Gemara la olam shenim sachar shkita vehem yibrachar shkita. No, it was found after the shkita of the other animal, and the tmur was made also, and therefore you can carry the shlom. What's the pasuk for asmach the baal? You don't need it. The chachamim leaned on it, leaned on that pasuk. Elakrolamai also. Well, then what do you bring a pasuk for? Kinetanya. Kesef. The rabbi says a pesach la'alya. The tail of a, of a sheep, if, if, if it has a sheep, a sheep has a tail, you can offer that as well. Kisha omer im kesef. The im comes the rabbi's pesach shabr shnosa. Korban pesach has to be an animal less than a year old. What's now it's over the year old? It can be offered. It's offered as a shlomim. And it has all the dinim of a shlomim. Now, what are the dinim? You have to lean on it. You have to use wine libations. You have to wave the breast and the thigh. Okay. Now that's a new Indian. Now that's a new Indian. A goat doesn't have a tail, and therefore you don't offer, you can't offer the tail of a goat. Now, some learn this dialogue on the ratio, meaning, you had an animal, you designated as a pesa, then you lost it. So you designated another, and then you found the original animal, and you haven't shechted. The, the replacement yet. And then you found this is the original Pesach that you found. Pesach Shinitsa Kordim Shinitsa Pesach. Yire Achi Yistoy Biyamotem. So that one is like a Kedusha Dechuya. So therefore it's lost its Kedusha. You don't offer it. You let it graze till it gets a moment. You sell it the Yavi Bidam of Shlom. The Chain Tmurasa. If you made a Tmura of that animal that you found, has the same din. And on the Rava, 
All of that is fine and good if all of this happened before the shechita of the, and the, the replacement animal that you had chosen. If the original animal, animal A, was found before shechita, then you shechted the replacement, then you made a tumor, then tumorosa crave a shlomi. Still says the Ebrahim, the tumor will be correct. My time one. Ki kavashchita. When you shechted, meet the chazale. He hadn't made it a tumor yet. So technically, it would have been fit to be shechted. But meet the loy chazale loy kavu. Only something that was not roy at that time would have not been kavu. But this was kava, that, that's why you can offer it as a shlom. So in Kesef, what do we learn from in Kesef? The rabbi is Tursa Pesach, Achra Pesach Shekrevish. That if you had a Korban Pesach and you made a Tmura of it, and now this animal is found after Pesach, you can offer it as a shlom. Okay. We'll stop here. Okay. So Friday, 3 30, is that it? Yeah, I think we can do both.